Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited. Um, I had said that I was going to be getting a tonic haul in, and that came in, but also arrived was a package that Tonic sent over uh, for the birthday week items, some of the items that I didn't have earlier. Uh, so, um, I'm going to share those with you. So those items that I'll show you were sent free of charge. You know, just try them out for my review, I suppose. And, um, of course, all opinions are my own. And any links I have in the description box will be affiliate links, which means I'll make a small commission if you're purchased items through those links. You guys, I had to drop everything. I was making a video working on this little sweet card <laughs> with some hunky-dory stuff. But I want to show you the Sorry, um, this area off. So I want to show you the um, items that I got for my haul and then today since today the launch of the birthday week began they are doing the carousel top um, gift box kit <laughs> I guess die kit or die set so I will show you guys that actually I'll show you guys that right now oh my gosh you guys ever since I saw that it was called carousel top I was like yep <laughs> I've just been super excited to get it um, you know look at the oh my gosh you guys how cute so big top carousel gift box die set and um, since this one is out and available now I do have it with the uh, carrier sheet and everything just the way it looks like if you were to pick it up which is really lovely so I always liked having that little inspo to check out um, it looks like it's on one sheet yes of ma one magnetic sheet so uh, what I can do is pop it out of this just so that we can not have a reflection I'll just take it out of this um, plastic casing but I will be right back and also there's usually more little inspo on the back of it oh you know what and there are instructions <laughs> love it so generally the instructions you know they go step by step there might be some things where it kind of goes from one to the other uh, but you have the images to look at too which is really helpful to figure that out if the uh, wording um, leaves a little something to the imagination right so we have that but I'm definitely going to do a whole tutorial on this of course you guys um, look how cute the way it opens up it has like this little area just kind of comes out like a little piece of pie <laughs> really cute and then again you can put the horses you don't have to put the horses I mean there's different examples here I mean how cute is that just as like a little thing here and then of course taller with the little horses back there just another part of the um, decoration there oh my gosh uh, so uh, what I want to do really quickly though for you guys just because we're just going to take a quick look at the dies is let you know how big the largest die is and I know on the cover it says that sometimes and but sometimes you know we overlook that info so I want to measure from the base of this die to like the top is like eight and a quarter and in the width it's about four inches so about eight and a quarter by four on that big guy and then this other, this one is probably the other largest die the rest of them are pretty small even in the width you know that would probably fit in a lot of uh, compact machines it's a six and a half inches tall and the width looks like at the pointiest part to here is probably seven and a half inches I would say so this is definitely the one you're gonna want to know that number four right uh, for your machine oh where was this it was like this was it like this nope <laughs> let me find the spot where this was and I will uh, be right back oh got it <laughs> Okay, I didn't want to waste your guys' time, but I got it. Okay, so there's the top piece. It looks like you only need a couple of those, you know, these different side pieces. Everything has inlays. Everything has topper pieces, so like topper with uh, scallop edge, a straight line topper. Um, again, the scallop and the straight lines, and then there's more, even more inlays that you can put in these guys. So we have like a little kind of very interesting pattern here. It looks like, I guess this one here, kind of like a rattan kind of weave. Do you know what I'm saying? Like it looks, it reminds me of like wicker kind of furniture and then of course we have the swirls so this one's a little bit larger this one looks like little leaves we have like this uh, geometric pattern a little floral one again all kinds of drop-ins and inlays that coordinate back with each other so like that bigger swirl you know the little leafy one the, again the little floral one um, the stripes are like the diagonal type of thing so they all coordinate and you have pieces to go right back to everything look at this this one just does its own with the little holes it's super cute all kinds of accent pieces and everything to get that done so I just want to show it to you guys a little quick unboxing and then just keep an eye out. I mean look at the little horsies how cute um, for a tutorial oh, I, guess I jumped right in and I didn't mention so in that little package that they sent over um, really sweet they sent me some goodies from uh, across the pond if you will look at this Welsh brew uh, pained I'm not sure what that says <laughs> our original premium tea blending teas for our wonderful Welsh water oh I wish I had that Welsh water <laughs> this is so fun I mean you guys know I love tea so this is awesome and look at this a little Welsh cakes snack, you guys, with currants and sultanas. Okay, I'm going to open this and take a little bite, okay? I'll so be right back. I mean, currants are their own thing, sultanas, but it's basically like like raisins, I guess, but you know, different. 
I am definitely going to have this with some, uh, a little uh, tea later, but oh my goodness. Oh, how sweet. I don't want to, I'm going to see how it's like on the top it has like little lines. I'll just taste a little bite from the side. Oh, as soon as I put it in my mouth, I can taste a little sweetness. This is definitely something I can get into. I'm going to have to look up how to make them. <gasps> oh yeah, because it's not, it's like soft, like cakey. I want to say like the outside of a Fig Newton, but softer than that, do you know? So good. Buttery. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me finish this bite. I'll be right oh back. Gosh. So good. And then of course the Sultan. Again, it's like a, like a, like a raisin. Really buttery. Oh my gosh. So good. Okay, so thank you so much, <laughs> Tonic, for those little treats there. Now, let me open up this box. This is the stuff I ordered last week, I want to say. So I know in here I have a mystery bag. It's a Nouveau mystery bundle. Sorry, you guys, so loud. Um, they're, they're doing that kind of often like when they do a mystery bag or a mystery bundle with Nouveau stuff. And sometimes it'll say like a certain amount of money for the $24.99 or whatever they're asking. Uh, sometimes it'll say it's seven items for that. Ten items. I think this one happened Sorry, to be guys, a ten item. It was kind of open at the bottom and the stuff slid out. So I think this is a ten item mystery bag. So let's check it out. Love this. Um, I actually have this, but it's really great because I love the black ink. And then it comes with the Clearmark embossing powder. So it's just their Nouveau hybrid inks uh, with the Metro Gray black shadow and the clear embossing powder. Ooh, these are so pretty, you guys. This one's Sparkle Spray and Frosted Bow. Really pretty. I think it has a little bit of a gold fleck. It's very subtle. You can just spray it wherever it looks super pretty. Oh, I haven't seen this packaging. This is adorable. Nouveau alcohol markers. Contains three pens, it says. I don't know if it's... Okay, <laughs> so I was like, on the outside it has three different colors. I don't know if it has to do with the colors or just... So I'm assuming, I mean, I don't know, but that these are the kind that blend together. Maybe they're already set up that way. I don't know. Sweet Vanilla, Apricot Blush, and Sand Castle. I mean, they look like these two definitely blend and then maybe goes into that one. 73, 75, 77. That should let us know. This is a pretty colorway. Okay. So here we have another set. Oh, so pretty. These are the different the colors I use very often. Cantaloupe, ginger peach, and fruit punch. And sometimes the numbers don't coordinate, but they still go together. Um, I have it, uh, a printout from whenever they had launched their alcoholic markers, this um, the second launch, or maybe third, I don't know, but the most recent launch. And so I do have how these guys blend together well. Coconut shell, garlic clove, and brown sugar. And to be honest, all of these blend together really nicely. Look at how they're like neutrals. So I am happy to have basically a second one of these, especially because they don't have reinkers, so love that. Let's see. Aqua Flow in some beautiful colors. I don't think I have any. I might have this one. It looks familiar, but these other two. It is French Wine, Wild Phlox, and Cinnamon Stick. Again, puts color and um, glitter, kind of like this, but like in a pen. So, something similar. Ooh. So we have the Nouveau Classic Colors. Uh, uh, color pencils. So pretty. I'll definitely try these out as we go along. So color pencils, of course, you can blend them if you really, really work them together. And if you use Gamsol, things like that. So different ways to work with those kind of things. I was just curious what a mystery bag might look like, so I grabbed this. Uh, Japanese maple, look how pretty that is. Oh my gosh, it's like burgundy, but it has a brown tone, really pretty. And a Nouveau Mica Mist over here. And um, silver smoke is the color. Ooh, I was gonna say, where's the lid? We got the lid here. This one is really nice. Uh, a lot of times with the Mica Mist, I'm using like these little guys. See this guy? But look at the full size. Wow. <laughs> so really nice. And then um, it comes with a little tote bag. So with birthday week, I know they're um, doing different like little free things they're going to add to like the orders with like the little Nouveau key rings or like all these cute things. Um, and then you get a bag over, I think, $70 orders. I'm don't remember and then something free with a $50 order but this is the bag that came with this one and uh, let me open this crafting the art of looking for something you had two seconds ago and isn't that not the truth <laughs> so cute so they have all these uh, fun tote bags you'll get one at random uh, with a 70 or more order uh, again that came with my mystery bag I have some other items that were on sale at the time they've been running sales where it's like the time's ticking down or um, you buy three and you get one free kind of thing. Things like that. So I think that's when I picked this up. I guess it was last week. If it's still going on, I'll link it there. But the little handbag, the delicate floral handbag uh, die set. Again, it's hard to tell how big things are when you're seeing kind of like a little picture like this. But it makes a good size bag. 
Um, really adorable. Again, it just kind of comes in like this. There's a little base piece that you can put on the inside. Um, it looks some, maybe that piece. Oh my gosh, you guys, I was, I'm so silly. I was like explaining what the base piece is, but um, it's this basically. <laughs> That's a, uh, it makes like a little tray for the inside. Or you can just leave it open and let whatever contents just kind of come out when they open it. But you do have like a little tray in there. Um, this one is the, uh, this one is actually a newer release. It's the Elegant Ascot Gift Box Die Set, and I have been looking forward to this one. I don't believe this one was part of the sale. Yeah, that was something else. Like I said, this is a new release. Um, but I did grab this, and I grabbed the, um, like, paper crafting bundle. I think that was the Elegant Ascot paper crafting bundle, I think. We'll show it to you in just a minute. Uh, but look how cute these are, and they can be taller, shorter. It's just a really nice size, cute little gift box. And you guys, I am just, I love making boxes. I am <laughs> all in. Uh, this is the Hidden Liaison Hexagon Box Die Set, and I have been eyeballing this one. And it has, look at, it even has little, like, a shelf, you know, to keep them separate. Um, four little boxes, and you can make it taller if you like, or whatever you want to do. Of course, it'd be really long at that point, but you know, you can adapt these things. How cute though, oh my gosh. Looking forward to playing with that. And then this one really piqued my interest. I don't even think I had seen this one when it came out. Uh, the Cherished Chest Gift Box Die Set. So super cute and it looks like it's a little thing. It's a good size box. So again, keep an eye out for the tutorial on that because I will definitely play with these. I mean, how cute is this? I, I just think it's adorable. I love the presentation. We open it up and then it has this beautiful little set inside there. Um, let's see here. Oh, you know what? Here's a little Nuvo key ring. That's basically what you'd be getting if you're placing an order, I think. Um, that, I don't recall if it's any order or orders 30 or more. I've been, i let you guys know what the birthday week things are, but right now, my head's all over the place. <laughs> okay, so this is a bundle I picked up. Beautiful paper, the... Uh, mariposa moments which means butterfly moments really really gorgeous paper I love it so I have one pack of it so I wanted to pick up another one and so when, it was in, so when it was in a bundle I went ahead and picked it up because it came with the pearled gold um, vellum and the pearled silver vellum which I'm just cutting into my vellum and doing all kinds of fun stuff with so just definitely wanted to get that Oh, yes, yes, yes. And this is another new release. Um, it was at the bottom of the box. Sorry, guys. The Decadent Drawer Gift Box Die Set. So I went ahead and picked that up. Um, look how cute. And they're all different. I mean, you see, these are all boxes. They're all, you know, I'm just a box collector, really. Um, I guess I collect a lot of things, don't I? But <laughs> the boxes are really, I love it. They're canisters, jars, all those things that um, Tonic and what they put together. Um, but how cute is this? Because it has like little drawers here and there. Like, oh my gosh. Just really stylized and awesome. I just think this is really fun. So, again, that was a new release. And then this bundle. So, this bundle is really nice. A lot of times it's nice to get, like, your basics bundles because they're just an awesome price. But, really, I wanted these clear dots. These are so cool. The clear drops. You can use these. There's little drops here and there. You can flood a little area if you want, you know, but you have to be a little more careful with it. But it looks really nice. So, uh, this is the crystal clear ones, which I love. And then, again, the black shadow. And this one comes with Safari Green. I think this was the bundle that goes along with the Plantastic Stampin' Die Set. Um... But I want to try it out because I don't have a lot, a lot of the colors, and this color was very pretty. Bright white, uh, six-inch square card bases, and then some craft card, which is always great. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. I will have links as appropriate. Uh, keep an eye out if I have a video for you uh, as birthday week progresses. Check out Tonic's videos, of course, and um, I'll have everything linked in the description box. And I'll see you guys at the next one. Bye now.